Hi guys, welcome back to another video. In today's video, I'm giving one of my friends, Fall, a private dressage lesson in Metal Queens. The first move she is learning is a ladder. So on the first go, you would curl comb way called. Second go, you will curl comb opposite way called. And that results with a normal merged line. Just how she is doing it right now. And that is how you do the move ladder. We will do it one more time. This is a multi-level dressage lesson, which means all of these moves are different levels. So ladder again, first go, curl comb, way called. Second go, she will curl comb, opposite way called. That makes the line merge again into a single line following the lead in the same order. Just like that, and that is how you do the move ladder. Ladder is also a beginner dressage move. The next move that she's learning is Lush. Now Lush is an advanced move. It has four goes. First go keyhole way commander called. Second go keyhole way commander called. Third go keyhole way commander called. And fourth go again keyhole way the commander called. You go the same direction throughout the whole entire move. All riders do the exact same thing. I'm just demonstrating it for fall just to recap it because I know that she does know it. Now, the reason why this is an advanced move is because keyholes can be really tricky on that comb alignment and you really wanna make sure it's nice and neat. Up next is Rose Fate. Rose Fate is an intermediate move and it only has one go. Also, if you're not getting these moves, it is okay. Just rewatch the video until you understand how to do them. They're fairly simple, so it shouldn't take you too long to learn them. Now for Rose Fate, since it has one go, it's pretty easy, let me demo it. So first go, you would fate, direction called. Second go, you would lock up, same way that you did the fate. So you would fate right, then you would lock up and to the right. So right now I'm in lock, and if you don't know lock, watch another private listen video that just focuses on lock and that is how you do rose fate so again one go first go fate and go up second go lock same way you did the fate and that's how you do rose fate again rose fate is an intermediate move now we'll be doing another intermediate move called box curl so first go you would comb second go merge way called third go comb back Fourth go, merge to original line. It should set you in the normal line order, going to your lead at wall. That's how you do box curl. It's a bit hard for you guys to get the concept of it by showing it just by myself, but that is the idea of how to do box curl. Now we will be doing a beginner move called fish. Basically, you would half curl over, then slant back to the wall like a bear. And that is how you do fish, like Fall just did it. And my little example on the screen right here that I did. <laughs> the other beginner move is bow tie. Bow tie is like fish, except you would slant up instead. It looks like my little example that I have on the screen to the right right here. And I will also demo it. So basically, it's like a keyhole but then you would slant up from that keyhole. It's kind of like fish and a keyhole combined. They're a bit different though, but they're pretty easy to learn. So again, just rewatch the video if you need to and let me demonstrate bow tie now. Again, fish and bow tie are both beginner moves. They are a little bit different with the slants involved. So this is how you do bow tie. You would do like a keyhole, but then you would slant upwards and it makes a bow tie shape. And fish also makes a fish like shape, hence its name. I hope you guys understand those two moves. I know they can be a little bit confusing, but they are pretty easy. All right, so now Fall is gonna go ahead and try bow tie since she does know fish. So this is bow tie again, basically do a keyhole up into a slant line, just like that. And that is how you do bow tie. And obviously you can do these moves either direction that you want. All right, and I would just like to say that if you struggle with learning the beginner dressage moves or want to learn more dressage moves that are beginner related, on our website, it just came out recently under quenponylore.com on our website, we have Metal Queens' beginner dressage book dictionary where all of the moves are listed for free. Go ahead and check that out. 